Hey, what's going on YouTube? Twisted Tony here. Give a little talk about crystals. A little what they are, what they do. Got a lot of different pieces here. We're going to start in the middle. This right here is called Clear Quartz. That's actually a channeling crystal. It's got seven sides on it. And a small piece in the back. Small triangle in the back. I don't know if you can see that. That's a really beautiful piece if you ask me. It's been handcrafted. Then you got the more raw forms. What clear quartz is, it's naturally occurring terminated point. Six sided. It's got always has six sides to it. Um, it's good for all your chakras, and it energizes all the chakras. It can ma it can magnify other crystals. There's different variations. You got faceted quartz, that little ball right there, and you got the crystal skull. Um, you can get them in wire wrapped form. Um, that's shamanic shamanic rudal quartz dream quartz see how it's golden that's a normal rudal quartz right there just got the black inclusions in it now citrine is a form of crystal quartz and also so is amethyst but we're going to get back to that in a minute citrine it's good for your solar plex chakras it's good for manifestation that right there See if we can get a clear shot. It's called a Herkemeyer diamond. I can't really get a clear shot of it. It's very small. It's got double terminated points. Got another one over there too. Double terminated points. It's a really good manifest or a magnification crystal. All right, this is a pothlet right here. I showed it earlier. It's really good for getting to know your spirit getting to know spirit guides um you can use it for spiritualist spiritualistic meditation different different things uh that's called lapidolite it's really good for um for dreaming so you'd want to have it in a grid in your bedroom along with that back there that's all Celestite. Celestite's really good for astral travel. Um, it's good for your for your third eye chakra. Over here we got the more darker um, tourmaline, black tourmaline. Good for rooting and sacral. Garnet, also good for rooting and sacral. Really beautiful crystal. It's got a reddish tone to it. If you can see, it's not just black. It's kind of sparkly. That's called Onyx. I'm a Leo, so Onyx is a very big, very big crystal for me. Um, and then we got Smoky Quartz. Smoky Quartz is good for your root and sacral chakras also. It's good for meditation to keep you rooted um, to the ground when you're meditating. We got some other pieces of Amethyst over here. Different points. Those are also... In the quartz classification, that's just a beautiful piece of amethyst. So what amethyst is, is it is a crown and third eye chakra crystal. It's good for psychic, um, psychic abilities. It's a protection crystal from psychic attacks. It's a good sleeping crystal. It helps you sleep. Nice deep sleep. We got celestite over there. That's a that's a really special crystal. Never needs cleansing. Never needs programming. It can actually cleanse and program other crystals. But yeah, this is just a basic crystal. You know, if you're trying to get into crystals, these are some of the things you want to look for. These most of these crystals were a part of my grid for my other 
I'll show it to you real quick. My grid. I'm not going to explain these ones. This will be a, another video. I'll have the grid set up. It's not set up fully right now. Like I said earlier, spirit animal will be a lion because I'm a Leo. Although your spirit animal doesn't necessarily mean a Leo, that that'll be your... This is another piece of Celeste right there. What I showed you earlier. Citrine, what I showed you earlier. Citrine. That's called Adventuring. It's a worry stone. So you just rub your thumb on there. Get worry out of you. It's good for um, your heart chakra. It's also good. It's one of the most lucky crystals. You would want to keep it with you. Goldstone. And pyrite. Lapis, lapis lazuli. It's got pyrite in it. The gold flex. It's obelisk. Copper. Copper is a good healing crystal. Topaz. Hematite. This is actually the magnetic form of hematite. That sometimes these hematite crystals get uh, carried away. Yeah, look for more uh, videos on crystals. Twisted Tony, subscribe. Check me out. I got other videos. Yeah.